Exploring the phrase, write off in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase, write off. This phrase can be a bit tricky for learners, so we're going to break it down, explore its meanings, and look at how it's used in different contexts. Whether you're a beginner or advanced learner, understanding these nuances can really enhance your fluency. Let's get started. The phrase, ride off, typically brings to mind an image of someone leaving a place on a horse, bike, or motorcycle. At its most basic level, it refers to the act of departing or moving away from a location while riding some form of transportation, usually a horse in historical or romanticized contexts. However, there's more to it than just the literal meaning. Let's explore further. Literal meaning, in the most straightforward sense, ride off is used when someone leaves a place by riding an animal or a vehicle. Example. After the meeting, she decided to ride off on her bicycle. Figurative meaning, metaphorically, ride off can imply leaving a situation, often abruptly or without planning to return. It is commonly used in the phrase, ride off into the sunset, which means to conclude something in a dramatic, romantic, or satisfactory way. Example, the movie ended with the heroes riding off into the sunset, suggesting a happy ending. There are several variations and collocations with ride off that are worth knowing. Ride off into the sunset. As mentioned, this is often used to describe a perfect, romantic, or idealized ending. Ride off in anger, leaving a place in a state of anger or displeasure. Example, he was so upset that he just got on his motorcycle and rode off in anger. Ride off on something. This is used when specifying what the person is riding. Example, she rode off on her scooter, weaving through the traffic. When using ride off, it's important to be aware of some common mistakes. Don't confuse it with ride out. Ride out means to endure a difficult situation not to leave a place. Context is key, make sure the context implies movement or departure. Using ride off in a static situation can be confusing. Use with motion. Ride off is odd when used with non-transportation methods. For example, saying he rode off on foot is incorrect. I hope this video clarifies the meaning and usage of write off for you. Remember, it's all about context and the nuance of departure or conclusion. Keep practicing, and soon you'll be using this phrase like a native speaker. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful English language tips. Happy learning!